as one of the longest-serving vessels in the history of the United Nations Navy. The venerable Truman-class dreadnought has protected the interests of Earth across the solar system for decades. Though not as sleek or sophisticated as her Martian counterparts, the Truman-class is famed for her sturdiness and reliability, serving as the immovable center of a UNN battle group through any manner of engagement. At a length of 376 meters, the space frame of the Truman class encapsulates the simple and utilitarian style of the United Nations Navy. The ship is propelled by a cluster of six Bush Shipyard's S-400 series Epstein drive assemblies, working collectively to accelerate or break the vessel's enormous mass with great efficiency. The standing crew complement of a Truman class dreadnought includes 1,400 individuals, supplemented by a sizable contingent of Marines for use in boarding actions or as shipboard security. The Truman is armed with a pair of adjustable Farron pattern high yield railguns, able to inflict lethal damage over vast distances. These weapons are supported by 42 Redfield Ballistics point defense cannons spread across the surface of the Dreadnought for maximum defensive coverage, as well as nine auto loading torpedo bays compatible with a variety of warheads. The Truman's effective targeting range is shorter than that of most Martian vessels, but the Dreadnought's extensive point defense grid allows the vessel to endure even the largest torpedo volleys, protecting the ship from harm while she coordinates fleet movements or brings her railguns to bear. The Truman's Farron Patton railguns are some of the most powerful and accurate weapon systems available to the UNN, matched only by the most advanced MCRN railguns and by the UN's fixed orbital gun platforms. These weapons are able to strike a target almost instantaneously when fired from within 1,000 kilometers, launching an unguided tungsten projectile that will effortlessly perforate the full mass of a targeted craft, tearing through multiple decks and often striking a critical subsystem to neutralize the target vessel in a single shot. The Truman's midsection features a pair of large shuttle bays, accompanied by external docking clamps. This area is used to house the Dreadnought's complement of L-type dropship skiffs, as well as a number of short-range repair platforms and recon drones. Though the Truman is not quite large enough to carry torpedo boats or corvettes in the style of the MCRN Donager class, the ship's embarked dropships widen the Truman's mission profile to include marine deployment and surface reconnaissance. Perhaps the most valuable trait of the Truman-class Dreadnought is the ship's versatility. Few vessels are able to serve as both a battleship and a troop transport without sacrificing effectiveness in both areas, but the streamlined design of the Truman-class allows the vessel to carry out missions that would otherwise require the presence of a small flotilla. This high level of adaptability has earned the Truman its impressive reputation and serves as an enduring reminder that technological sophistication is often no substitute for a simple and reliable design.